He's on uh, VH1's Best Week Ever. He's like the new cyber star compared to the, uh, the Star Wars kid. Now, meanwhile, this is February 2005, and meanwhile, YouTube is just then being created. So Chad, Steve, and Jawed are just registering it. On April 23rd, 2005, they launched YouTube. They have the first videos posted on that day. And this is really interesting because it actually creates a new type of platform. Up to this time, it was actually really difficult to upload video to the web. And now suddenly, everybody can join in this Numa Numa craze, and they did. As you can see, over 58,000 uh, videos have now been uploaded. And you'll see just people all over the world joining in this dance. And this, this then becomes sort of something really important that's going on. And again, Gary Wolk has this great line when he's talking about this. He, start, he says, they start to look less like an infectious joke than a new cultural order. These kids aren't mocking the Numa Numa guy, they're venerating him. And they're beautiful to see because they're replicating and spreading his happiness. They're following a ritual that's meaningful if not yet venerable, learning the dance, lip singing the song, documenting their performance just so, making it available for the world to see. So I kind of like to think of Gary as the first guy on the dance floor of this global mixer. And, and, <laughs> and there's a lot more going on than just dancing. And you know, you think about the joy that people are expressing and the fun that they're having uh, as they do this dance. And I like to think of it as more than just a dance, it's a celebration. It's a celebration of new forms of empowerment. New, you know, anybody with a webcam now has a stronger voice and presence. Uh, it's a celebration of new forms of community uh, and types of community that we've never really seen before, global connections transcending space and time. It's a celebration of new and unimaginable possibility. And so, you know, you can say that this is all hype, like these are just people dancing and having fun, but think about what they're dancing in front of. They're dancing in front of about a billion boxes in places all over the world that are networked together and allowing us to connect in ways we've never connected before. And in fact, they can actually invent new ways to connect with each other, and it's getting easier and easier to do so. And so some, that's why I like to think that this is really just a very important moment. We'll